I did something. Oh my goodness. Okay, I did that completely wrong. Not automatically connecting. Hello, welcome. If you are new, my name is Callie. You can hear my dog drinking in the hallway. Um, he does everything at the time that I need him not to do it. Like if I need him not to play with a toy, he's playing with a toy. When I don't care if he's playing with a toy, he doesn't touch it. Anyways, it's not what I came on here for. Hello, if you've clicked on this video, you know what it's about. Here's the thing, have I purchased them yet? No. Um, I can't decide what color I want. I can't decide if I actually want to purchase them. Um, I have been looking at them for six months now. Uh, and I think that I'm to the point where I'm finally going to just like bite the bullet and do it. Um, but I don't really know. <laughs> it's for the AirPod, AirPods Max, which I would think they're called AirPod Maxes. But that's probably in proper English. AirPods Max is probably the correct AirPod Pros, AirPod Maxes, AirPods Max. Anyways, I don't I don't know why that sounds so off to me. That is what we're talking about today. I have the I used to have like the just first generation basic AirPods, lost them, got the AirPod Pros, and I love them, but they fall out of my ear. So I have been I spend a lot of time on my computer. School is all on my computer, all my lectures. I work a lot on my computer. Um, there's just so much, like editing. There's so much stuff that happens on my computer. So I'm really always like in a coffee shop or doing something on my computer. And my AirPods, I love them, my AirPod Pros, but they do fall out of my ear a lot of times. So I started looking at the AirPod Maxes or the AirPods Max, whatever the whatever they're called. Started looking at them about six months ago. These little suckers, they're, they're $600, like, for, so, I know there's so many other headphones out there, I've had Beats, like, I got them way while ago in high school, and I've had that same pair forever, um, and I like them, but they hurt my head really, really bad if I have them on for a long period of time, they just, like, crush, I get really bad headaches from them. Um, and mine for some reason, like never hold a chart. I don't know. There's something wrong with mine, but I just use my, the in-ear AirPod Pros and I've loved them forever. But when I'm walking, they fall out. Like if I'm going on a walking, I'm walking Ollie. I'm always concerned about having a hand free that I can push them back in because they always fall off my ear. Somehow AirPod Maxes, whatever they're called, has become a street style trend and people wear them out and about and like style their outfits around them. So I have not even put a pair on my ear. That's what we're gonna do today. I have to go to work first, adulting. And then we're gonna go look at them and see if I want to get them. I'm between the space gray, the silver, and the green. I probably won't get the green because I will get tired of color really fast, but I don't know if I will want the space gray or the silver. That's the dilemma for today. I've got to take my dog on a walk so that I'm not late to work, but you will see just like you're going to find out the same time that I find out if I'm going to actually get these, but I want to go and try them on first and then see if I can just swoop them up. That's the update for today. Ollie, you ready to go for a walk, buddy? We got to go. I'll see you in a little bit. So we got them. I ended up going to work. And I thought about it and thought about it and thought about it and thought about it. And then I was like, why not? So we got them. Here they are. Um, let's try them on. I went into the store and I tried a pair on for the first time. I had never actually tried a pair on. I went to the actual Apple store, tried them on, looked at the different colors. They didn't have this color out. So I don't actually know exactly. I have an idea of what this color is going to look like, but I've never seen it outside of the box. Um, and tried them on. I'm not joking. I didn't try them on for very long, but they, they fit so comfortably like right here around my ears. I always have jewelry in. So that was like a concern because my 
beats, like they're circular, they like push on my jewelry and ends up always giving me a headache. But we're gonna open these. I think I need to find a spot that's better lighting because this is the least professional um, unboxing you'll ever watch in your life, just to let you know that. And yeah, let's go find a spot. We're gonna sit in my bedroom on the floor, but these are them. Look how cute they are. Here was my thing about getting the space gray. I was really deciding between, I think I said this earlier, I was deciding between the green, the space gray, and the silver one. Okay, so I went in. The green one was way too green. I It's a, like a very pretty green. Like honestly, if I had to choose a color, I would go with that one. It's very pretty, it's gonna go with everything. It's light, it's airy. I really liked it, but it really, it was, I don't know if I'm saying it right. It's a lot more green than I thought it was gonna be. Does that make sense? And then the silver ones, I really liked them, but I looked at the like little muffs part that like go on your ear and they had like, because of everyone that's I'm sure gone in there and used them, they were like kind of dirty looking. They were kind of dirty looking. So I was like, okay, I don't really want those. So I went with these ones, I got them, look at them. They're the space gray, I'm obsessed with them. Okay, we're gonna open them. Where does it open? Where does it, here it is. Here it is. <gasps> okay, all right. Oh, wait. Okay, I did that completely wrong. Look at, okay, all right, well. I messed the wrapping up already. Wait, I'm so excited. I've been like wanting these for six months. Like this was not like an impulse like, oh, I think I might want them, I want them. I've been like wanting them for so long. So you know when you've been wanting something and you've like held yourself back from it uh, and then you finally, ah, oh, wait, I'm so excited. Okay, hold on, anyways. I'm taking the wrapping off and oh, wait. Okay, why is this a little bit harder than I want it to be? There it is. Look! They look like nothing! You can't tell because they're wrapped in paper. But look at this. They smell weird. Okay, they smell really weird. Here they are. Here's the thing, everyone keeps complaining about this case. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm kind of a fan of it, because look at this. It's like a purse. Look at that. Okay, anyways, on to the next. Okay. I feel like the unboxing of these is not as like cool as like unboxing a phone or like unboxing a, a MacBook. So you take these off. And then these have little muffs on it. You take little muffs off. <gasps> Look at them. Wait, I'm so glad I went with this one. Okay, here's the thing. Do they kind of look like headphone, um, like airport headphones? Yes, okay? But like, are you joking? Are you joking me? Look at this. Can you see? Come on. Oh my Lord. Poor Oliver. I'm gonna just, I'm not even gonna hear you. I'm just gonna be walking around with these on all the time. Guys, look at this. I'm not gonna lie, they are a little heavy, but they're not like, hi buddy. They're not like insane heavy. Let's put this box aside. Here's the case. And people really, here's the thing, I gotta take these off because I don't have them on and they are like, they've like muffled my own voice. Okay, people are really hating on this case. Here's the thing, I like it. They're calling it a bra, they're calling it all these mean names. And I really like it. I think it's, yes, I don't think necessarily it's like as protective as it could be, but I think it's like conducive to like putting it in like a tote bag. I think maybe if I was throwing this in a backpack, I'd be a little bit more worried. But honestly, if I had a backpack, I might just carry these so that they're not just thrown in there. I, the case feels really nice. It's like flappy and like magnetic there. Apparently it's a smart case. Guys, okay, I have little to no information about these, but the little information I have, I'm gonna tell you. Apparently it's a smart case, and so when you put the headphones in here, it forces them into like the lowest battery like way that they can go. It like forces them um, to use like the least amount of like energy. 
So it's called a smart case. I think that's all it does. There's like, it's really like soft on the inside. Like it's high quality. It really is high quality. And there's a little, their little in logo is in there. I don't know if you can see it. Can you see that? It's just like designed by Apple. But I like this. I like this case. I think it's nice. Um, if I think they could have done that version, but like in a hard case, that would have been nice. But the thing with that is then I feel like it's like, I don't know. I'm not hating on this. I think practicality, probably they could do better, but you know what? It works for what I need it for. These little things, like, okay, there's supposed to slide out. There we go. That's metal, which apparently is why these are heavier than most other headphones because normally they use plastic. This is real metal. So they are a little bit heavier, but listen to me. The quality of these is literally insane. Like these feel like luxury. Like this is high end. This is expensive. You know it's expensive. I'm obsessed with them. I I would not have liked them as much if I would have got the silver. I am so glad I went with these ones. Listen to me. I haven't even set it up. I need to set it up. Here's the thing. They are a little heavy. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like they do feel like a little, I feel like I kind of want to keep tilting my head forward. So they are, maybe I'll just stretch them out a little bit. There we go. Okay, wait, that's better. Okay, let's set them up to my phone. They're supposed to like automatically connect. Why aren't you automatically connecting? Not automatically connecting. Okay, I'm gonna try it again. If I take them out. just comes up and it has like this little thing it just says like noise control press the digital crown okay let's just skip all that <gasps> they're 43 percent charged okay let's go to done okay what should we play this is so good wait and now i can hear my Oh, wait, this transparency mode is so good. Okay, listen, I didn't believe the hype at first because I felt like the AirPod Pros like have the transparency mode, but it just like magnifies everything. And so I've never really liked it. This makes me feel so much more comfortable because I feel like I could go somewhere like to a coffee shop or on a walk or something like that. And I don't love to have like no noise. Like I love soundproofing and like the noise cancellation and all of that. But sometimes it just makes me feel very nervous when I can't hear anything around me. So I personally, this is probably my favorite feature is the transparency mode because I can listen to the music and it's still really loud, but I can also still hear things that are going on around me. Game changing. Okay. Now I listen to like, just like, some like good music. Now I'm gonna pump it up. We're gonna listen to Honest by Justin Bieber, okay? Are we ready? <laughs> Guys, wait, I'm obsessed with them. Look at this, I'm yelling. Okay, these are so good. These are so freaking good. I'm I'm just gonna be, I'm just, if, if you choose to stick around and watch any other videos, you're just gonna see me all the time like this while you're on my apartment. You the one like this all the time, just walking around my apartment. Okay, spatial. It's like the... What? Okay, listen, nobody is talking about this, what? Listen to me, hold on. I'm gonna do the rest of this video with these headphones on because I could put it in transparency mode and fully hear myself talk. Um, and I wanna see like if these start to like make my head hurt as I wear them. 
you, there's this thing and it's like spatial audio or whatever and it has a head tracking mode so when you turn your head this way the audio like becomes bigger on this side and then when you turn your head this way it becomes bigger on this side excuse me what hold on listen that may not be like groundbreaking to anybody else that may have been around forever but it's groundbreaking to me it like literally like wow okay that's good. I'm not gonna lie to you, that's good. Here's the thing, I don't know if there's anything else special about them. I haven't really watched many reviews. Okay, I have, I've watched like two people, like YouTube like unbox reviews. Um, and then I saw them all over like social media, like Instagram, TikTok, stuff like that. Here's the thing, I'm a fan of these, come on. Are they expensive? Absolutely. Do I think that you have to get them? Absolutely not. I think that there are so many other options out there, like just really do your research and figure out kind of your budget and there's going to be headphones that are gonna fit your budget that are going to probably be more practical. Um, I just have gotten way too far into like the app. Can I talk? I've just gotten way too far into the, like the Apple ecosphere thing. Um, that I'm like hooked, like they have me fully hooked. I understand. Are these a necessity? Absolutely not. They are a nicety. Um, and I think, yeah, there's so many other options. I really love them. I think that they fit everything that I need them for. Like they're so comfortable, it's not even funny. And while I'm working on my laptop and doing calls and stuff like that, like these are just gonna be Perfect. I think they look a little funky. Like, if you just think about it, somebody walking like this, I look like I like am at like an air an airport trafficker. Um, like, you know what I mean? Like, need to be out there like waving because they wear these big headphones. Or, um, growing up <laughs> when my papa would mow the lawn, uh, he would wear like the big headphones. So I kind of feel like that as well. Um, but they're a vibe. I'm not gonna lie to you. These are good. These are really, really good. Guys, I'm not, I'm not even just saying it. These are, these are good. These are genuinely good. I think I've seen so many things that people hate about them and I think it just really depends. It's, it's a person by person thing. Go in the store and actually try them first. But I'm telling you, I know a lot of people are talking about how heavy they are. I have a headache already, like just from the day. So I'm probably not, now's not the best time for me to like, figure out like if these give me a headache or not but these are so good the sun is moving and it's really messing with everything but I guys as of right now I have no complaints I don't think that they feel like overly heavy where I'm like trying my best to get them off my head I think they definitely are heavier like I do feel a difference when they're not on there and so maybe for like long 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 amounts of times these are going to get heavy but honestly i feel like most headphones i've had um start to feel that my biggest concern is more like they start to feel like they're crushing my head and these don't feel like they're crushing my head at all like these feel like they just feel so good i guys these are just so good i'm sorry if you like if you hate them I really like them. I've only had them for a day. I'm gonna wear them around a little bit more. I will update you as time goes on how I'm still liking them. I think I have, what, like two weeks to decide if I wanna keep them or not. It was a big purchase. It They are very, very expensive. I think that's the biggest complaint that I would have with these is that they're like kind of absurdly expensive. I'm not gonna lie to you. Uh, and especially with there being so many different versions that are similar to it, they are very expensive, but I really, really, really love them. I'm obsessed with them. I think Apple did what Apple does best and they made the design very sleek, very aesthetic, very just simple. Guys, they're so good. They're so good. They also feel very, very, very high quality. They better for that price. Um, sound quality i think it's really good there's gonna be different sound qualities there's gonna be other sound qualities you probably like better for me these work like come on are you kidding every time i put them on always playing music 
Okay, so here's the thing. I can't hear myself talking right now, like at all. I like know that I'm talking, obviously, because I'm talking, but I can't hear myself. Now I can hear myself. That is insane. Okay, that's insane. Also, people keep saying they're not that loud. I guess I could see where it would kind of come across that they were like not that loud, but they're pretty loud. Like they, they're loud. They're just like not gonna burst your eardrums loud, you know? Okay, that's my little take on these headphones. I think they're really cute. I don't mind this case. A lot of people hate it. I think it's cute. I think it's simple. I'm, I'm really, really, really in love with them. We'll see as time goes on if I keep that up. But as of right now, I don't have any complaints. I'm so excited for them. Like, I think they're so cute. Listen, this may not be your cup of tea. You may not love it. It's nothing to ever push on somebody to do something that they aren't in a place to do. That's never it. It's never shaming. It's never bragging. It's never what it's about. It's just sharing something that I'm really excited about with you. Maybe you've got them. Maybe you don't have them. Either way, if you have them, if you don't, let me know if you're wanting them, if you hate them, that's fine too. I think that the cool thing about there being so many different options is there's something that fits everybody's desire and their need and their want and all of that. So there are so many people making dupes of these as well. I've seen them at like Target and Macy's and all these different places where you can get the similar style. If you're like focused on the style, obviously the quality is gonna be much different, but the style is gonna be the same. Um, and then Sony has some, Bose has some, Beats have some like over ear headphones that are really high quality and they're much cheaper. They're still expensive headphones because headphones are expensive in general, but they are much cheaper than these little guys. But if these are in your budget and you have been wanting them and you're just using them for day-to-day -day stuff, just looking for like day-to-day, -day, like maybe you work on your computer, you are a student, you edit videos, like stuff like that. These are really, really good. Um, you travel a lot, whatever it is. I think these are really good. I just have to give my opinion. I love them. And I saw somebody post, I think it was on Instagram or it was like a meme or something like that, where it said, um, no, it was, a, it was a video. And the girl was like, <laughs> if you had beats in high school, you're definitely trying to get these. And it's very true. I had beats in, high school i think like towards the end of high school i got them for like christmas one year like the the studio ones and so i i automatically was obsessed with these but that is all i have to say my leg is falling asleep i'm obsessed with these these are so cute look at them they have this color silver green Blue and pink are the colors that they have in them. They come in these little carrying cases. The case like matches the headphone color. It's so cute. I'm obsessed with these. I'm so glad I went with the like space gray ones. Guys, these are good, okay? That's all I have to say. Thank you for spending time with me. I'm sorry, I can't get over these. Look at them. Like, look at them. It's just a cute little case. Like, I get it. It's not for everybody, but come on. Okay, anyways, I'm a fan. That's all I have to say. We'll see, we'll see if I stay a fan. I have two weeks to decide. So fingers crossed that I like them, but also my bank account wouldn't be mad if I didn't like them. You know what I mean? I'll be here. Oh wait, also last thing. There's apparently a left and a right side. You're supposed to like wear them. Like that's the left side, that's the right side. And apparently the microphone only works if you wear it properly. But apparently I saw this. They don't lay flat unless you wear them on the opposite side. So I don't know. I never am gonna, I never really wear them like this. If I do, this doesn't bother me. But nine times out of 10, if I'm not wearing them, they're gonna be in the case. That's just, I never really was someone who wore like headphones around my neck. Who knows? I may say that and then become the person that always has headphones around my neck. I don't know. My hair is just too like, it's too curly and too like, there's too much of it always on my neck for me to have something else. You know what I mean? Okay, that's it. I'll be here literally for the rest of the day. Can I hear myself? I can hear myself, watch. Now I'm about to disappear. I can't hear myself. It's over.
It's gone. Ah! I'm obsessed with them. Okay, bye. Hello. Okay, so it's two weeks later now so i'm editing this video but it's two weeks from the day that i got it so my window of taking them back is officially about to close when today is over and i've got to tell you i'm not taking them back here's the thing i did see somewhere that they're talking about launching an airpods max 2 in the fall and i'm like did i jump the gun like i waited too long for them to still be like to get them like fresh when they were like new and then be old by the time, not old, but you know what I mean? Like me, have you really used them by the time a new pair came out? But they're talking about like possibly being cheaper. That's not, that's not what I came on here to tell you. I did just see that and I was like, do I return them and wait? But I've had them for two weeks now. I've used them a lot. I've taken them to the gym. I've done Pilates in them. Like obviously Pilates from home. I did not go to a Pilates studio and wear these. I'm not that dedicated. I've taken Ollie for a bunch of walks. I've studied in them. I've done work in them. A whole bunch of different things. And I have to tell you, I genuinely am still obsessed with them. Like I genuinely love them. I don't know if I will not love them. They're not too heavy on my head. I was really nervous about that. They worked really well in the gym. When I was doing Pilates, obviously like you're like turning your head a lot and like you're like down in a plank and stuff a lot. That didn't bother me. Like I just really, really love them still. So still a thumbs up for me. My time of returning them is almost over. So they're a keeper for me. I still love them. And um, yeah, just for everything I've needed them for, I feel like they've succeeded. So wanted to give you that little update because it's officially been two weeks since I got them and I still love them. I still, guys, I literally mourn taking them off. I'm so dramatic, I'm aware, but I get so sad when I take them off. I'm like, oh, it's bad. There's something wrong with me. That's beside the point. Have the best day. Thank you for watching and I'll see you later.